In this video, I'm going to show you how to boost your FPS in Fortnite brand new chapter 5 with your any low end PC or laptop. After the release of brand new Fortnite chapter 5, Fortnite feels very choppy and laggy. And today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix all these issues. So guys, make sure to watch my this whole video and be wasting any time. Let's dive straight into over this video. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to disable the power throttling on your Windows. So guys, for that, press Windows R together from your keyboard and type gpedit.msc and press enter. Now you need to go for computer configuration. Go for for administrative template then go for windows component and there you will find out app privacy option go for it then scroll down and there you will find out let's window app run in the background so go for this option now simply enable the setting from here after that go for default for all app and set it on default deny after that hit apply and click ok once you're done now you need to go back into the main directory and now this time go for administrative template now go for system now scroll down until you find power management so go for power management and there you will find out windows power throttling setting so go for it and there you will find out turn off windows throttling double tap here you need to enable the settings for disabling the power throttling after that hit apply and click ok now in the next step we are going to configure some best windows update and windows private settings so for that search for windows update and open up your windows settings and guys make sure to always update and download the latest driver and the latest version of the windows on your pc after that, go for delete optimization and make sure to turn off the settings from here. Now click on this home button and now simply go straight to the privacy tab. Now here in the general tab, you need to turn off all the settings. After that, go for speech. Make sure to also turn off this online speech settings. Now go for diagnostic and feedback and make sure to also turn off all the settings from here. Now you need to scroll down and find out here background app. So go for it and make sure to disable all the apps because it's very hard ready mining and guys use all the resources of your CPU and your GPU. So therefore make sure to turn off the background apps on your PC. After that go for app diagnostic and make sure to also turn off the settings. So guys now the next step you need to right click here on your Windows Star icon and open up system settings. Now go for advanced system settings. Open up performance settings and go for adjust for best performance. Once you select adjust for the best performance, all these boxes automatically uncheck. After that, guys, you need to go for show thumbnail instead of icon and check mark on this box. After that, hit apply and click OK. So, guys, now the next step you need to download these rules on your PC that is the MSI utility. So, double tap and open up MSI utility as the administrator. After that, you need to find out here your GPU model, whatever you have. So, I have NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070. So, you need to choose here your GPU. After that, go for Intra Priority and set it on to the high. After that, if you want to get lower input delay, so guys, go for Intel USB 3.20 and go for Intra Priority and set it on the high and hit apply and save the settings in the MSI mode utility. Now, on the next step, here we got NVIDIA Profile Inspector. So open up this folder inside here, you will find out this exe file. So right click here and run this as administrator. Most important guys message, this is only work for NVIDIA user. If you have an AMD, so you can go on my YouTube channel and watch a dedicated video how to do the best settings for your AMD control panel. So guys, once you are here in the NVIDIA control panel, now you need to search for Fortnite and open up Fortnite profile settings. After that guys, here we find out some hidden settings which is not available in the NVIDIA control control panels in the very first step go for sync and refresh rate and there you will find that low latency simply guys go for ultra low latency cpl state set it on the ultra and ultra low latency enable set it onto the on after that scroll down and go for anti analyzing now you need to go for anti analyzing transparency and super sampling click on the drop down and set it on to the double a mode all make sure to use the same exit number after that now scroll down Go for texture filtering quality there you will find out texture filtering LOD BOS DX and OGL for reducing the texture in your Fortnite. So guys for that go for this drop down and now you need to change this value so I will suggest you to go with plus 2.00. Now again go for the next value and set it on the plus 2.00. So once you apply the settings, this will reduce your texture, but if you want to reverse the settings, so guys, you can simply go back and reverse the settings onto the zero. Now here we go, texture filtering quality setting on the high performance, and guys, click on the apply button and apply these changes in the Fortnite. And guys, also if you want to reverse the settings back to the normal, so you can guys go for this restore current profile option, click on this button and this will revert all the settings back to the normal, then you can apply the settings on your PC. So guys, here in the next step, we find Melody low latency software, so guys, you need to open up this RAR file on your PC and this will help you to loading the input delay of your mouse and keyboard while you're playing fortnite in the brand new chapter 5. this is brand new application and very underrated but guys you can literally use it for reducing the input delay of your mouse and keyboard in fortnite so guys double tap here and open up this file after that you will find out here enable or disable latency mode so turn on the settings and this will enable the both option on your pc 
After that, simply click on the minimize and this will keep running in your background. So make sure to run this application before launching the Fortnite. So guys, now the next step we are going to configure the best settings for our Epic Games launcher. So guys, for that, open up your Epic Games launcher. Now you need to go for this profile icon and go for settings. Now here in the preference, you need to follow the settings like uncheck these old boxes, go for throttle stop and uncheck these boxes also from here. After that, go for desktop notification and uncheck the notifications option. Now you need to scroll down and there you will find that is Fortnite. So click on this drop down, go for additional command line agreement and make sure to use the same exact command also in the Fortnite Epic Games Launcher for improving your FPS and improving your ping in Fortnite. So guys now go for library and click on the three door of the Fortnite. After that go for options. And now from here guys you need to uncheck all these boxes from here if you are not playing the fortnite safety world so make sure to uncheck this box also then uncheck high resolution texture and directed 12 shader on your pc from the epic games launcher now here you will find our pre-download stream assets so also make sure to download this asset on your pc because this will help you to optimizing your ping while you're playing fortnite so guys simply hit apply and save the settings in the epic games launcher so guys now the next step we are going to configure the best fortnite config settings so guys for that press windows r together from your keyboard and type here percentage local app data percentage hit ok now you need to find out here fortnite game folder so go for it go for save config windows client and there you will find out Fortnite game user settings.ini file. So right click here, go for properties and make sure to uncheck the read only box from here, then hit apply and click OK. After that, right click here, go for edit. And now you need to find out here B show grass option. So guys, here we got our B show grass. Set it on default for disabling the grass in the Fortnite and that will help you to improve your FPS. After that, guys, here you will find out 120 fps mode set it on the false after that scroll all the way down until you find the scalability group setting and guys now you need to change here these settings onto the zero like it is right now onto the view distance on the epic so guys set it on the zero set all the anti thing, shadow quality post processing texture effect everything guys on the zero for having the better performance while you're playing fortnite so once you apply all these settings in your fortnite config settings so now you need to go to file option Hit save and guys close out the settings. So guys now here at the end if you want to reduce your ping in Fortnite. So guys I suggest you to download the gear booster on your PC. Link available down in the description. Simply go and download the software for free. And you will get 7 days free trial once you download this application from the given link. So guys now you need to simply log in here your account. After that you will find out all the available game on your PC. Like here is multiple thousand of the game you can choose. But for the Fortnite you need to click on this boost button. And this will start boosting and optimizing the best server for you which help you to get the lowest ping in fortnite you can choose here multiple server from the europe asia middle east north america brazil and ocean and guys you will get the better ping in your region and competitive advantage over your opponent so guys that's it for this video i hope so you love it so please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and make sure to share your opinion about this video in the comment section so till that next video peace out